Ready! 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 Hunky Killer has struck again. At 11.32 this morning at Park Avenue and 62nd Street, he shot and killed Mr. and Mrs. Marshall Lewis of Riverdale. His victim count now numbers 39 dead and 17 wounded. Anyone having information which might lead to the apprehension of the Hunky Killer is asked to call the special police number 581-7505. In St. Louis, the Mets beat the Cardinals 7-3. to three. Here now is Dr. Sam Shepard with the weather. The hunky killer will have a grim day tomorrow. Temperature will be in the low 20s. Winds from the northeast from 30 to 35 miles an hour. Sullivan show and one week I was guest host on a Johnny Carson thing. I also did 15 concerts and I turned down six Broadway musicals and a two-picture deal with Warner Brothers. Ah, but tomorrow night, 
back to Caesar's palace. I don't need the gig, but I'll do it because they give me my face break, you know what I mean? But I'll tell you one thing. If I don't get the front dressing room, I cancel. You owe me two dollars. What, are you kidding me? I'm a Mexican hairless. You owe me two dollars. What? Two dollars. I don't even know you. But four dollars. Lash you up. I feel the same way about iced tea. Oh, I have learned to live with my fetish, but I cannot live without my iced tea. I also chew pillows. I am a furry professor. Howdy, bub. I'm sorry. I thought it was you. She's okay. <laughs> Has anyone ever made it with a hamster? You better stop worrying about hamsters, because if we don't find a way out of here, it's all over. Face it, mate. There is no way out. Thank God. All I know is that a week ago, I was chasing this Dalmatian bitch up the West Side Highway. I finally caught her at Grant's tomb. But before I could score, the catcher jumps out of the bushes, puts the butterfly on her. And I hear him tell the driver that the bitch is so ugly that she'll probably never get adopted. And that they'd end up having to give it a needle. She ain't here, so they must have given it a needle. I've never walked through a puddle and I've never stepped on a flower. But Mr. Cheswick insisted I learn to heal. I tried, but his feet smelled so bad I couldn't walk next to them. I'd rather die than smell those feet again. You're gonna die. Gonna help us kill a keeper or what? You're talking about manslaughter. That's against the law. What are you, paranoid or something? How dare you call me a nymphomaniac! Chicken, thank you, tiger. What is this? I'm trying to get us out of here! And everybody's busting my hump! I'm a pure Siamese, but I'll join you. The cat's got smarts. Me, him, and Fido are gonna bust out of here. Who's joining me? But just tell me what you want me to do. What's your plan? What's your concept? If you get out of here, you do what you gotta do. That's your business. It's your business. In Chicago, I got arrested for going down on an elevator. <laughs> which will completely eliminate the fear and paranoia. Hey, Red, what time is it? It's after 11, but don't worry. If you say so. What's your name? Roland. What's yours? Mona. Are you ready to die? No. Are you? I'm scared shitless. Me too. <laughs> what are you doing? Don't tell me one. Has anybody got a pencil? One pencil, I could have written a great novel. I don't mind dying, but before I go, I'm turning state's evidence. I'm going to the DA with names and addresses, and when they're all up the river, this world will be a better place to live in. Huh? Jump, roll over, fetch, lay down, sit, play dead. When I do my tricks, she adore me, but when I get my ass right, it gives me so much pain, I could not do it. She hated me. You shouldn't have done the tricks in the first place. What gives you the right to criticize me? Because I'm unique. Unique? Every year this place puts the hundred thousand of us to sleep. Permanent, but so unique. They're free spirits now. They're people. You probably have emphysema. And you want the rest of us to die with you. I'm in perfect physical condition. I've never been down. I go the distance. <coughs> you touched my mammal tissue. The only scar tissue I have is psychological. I'm subjecting myself to punks like you. It's true, I am a punk. But what's a little immaturity amongst punks? Don't give me that psychedelic stuff. The only stuff I have is pure cocaine. The greatest sexual drug since Ava Brown. Yes, I know that you're feeling low If you want anything, just let me know I hope you're 
使我想到一条歌，然后呢，就是两个眼睛大大的，那声音嘛像个小女孩子，哎。How come you're in solitary? I got the mange. You ready to die? I had a wonderful time. How'd they get you? Aggravated arson. Pushed over the Christmas tree. It's a good thing they put me here. I had plans to go all the way. If I were a fish, I wouldn't have to listen to this. You are a fish. I can take you, Sasmo. Who you gonna take? It doesn't matter how I go. If you stick that thing in me, I'm home early. You can't intimidate me. Hey, brother, forget him. He's wino in the head. You and that knight can take us out of here. Give me the shiv. You and I'll be having lunch on the outside. Right? You can never be intimidated. You who have tasted the triumph of victory and the agony of defeat, no. Come on, Bimbo. We're the going over the top. They need to sever your flesh and cut your veins. Only vanity flows out. You are the reservoir of sports. You are the king of the ring. You are the incredible champion with those marble fists. That brain of steel, the organs of completeness that could not be destroyed. Your limbs are contained epoxy, and they hold together with the resinous and the hazardous to watch you mash and smash your opponent. Violence is no answer, you sugar ray, you. You have no right to take the law in your own hands. Only the government has the right to be violent. I can tell you this. Living in Texas, one night there's a tornado warning, so we all go down in the basement and we lay down in the southwest corner. The tornado hits, the lights go out, the wind is blowing, but we're all hanging on to each other like one piece of fear. The next morning we go upstairs, there's no more furniture, the roof's gone, and so's my hair. That tornado scared me so much it made my hair disappear. Have any hair on your bowl? I'm afraid to look. Don't be afraid to look at yourself. You're perfect. Now, what are you, crazy? I'm an ugly king. You're not ugly. What are you trying to do? He knows he's ugly. He admits he's ugly. He's a scumbag. I heard that, but she's right. There's nothing anyone can say or do that'll change the truth in his face. There's nothing to change. You're perfect. Ah, uh, nothing's perfect. I am. Um, uh, leave me alone. 
I'll tell you four things. He's not perfect, but he is beautiful. Are you making a pass at me? I'm out of my mind over you. Why? I have no taste. Take my laundry. Beautiful. Tony who? Tony Afghan. We met at the clubhouse at Forest Hills. The matches were on. We were alone for three hours. It was divine. He said, you're the most delicate bitch I've ever been with. God, what a fantastic thing to say. Did he play tennis? He played everything. He was brilliant, but not annoyingly brilliant, if you know what I mean. No, but I'm not linear. I do think I am, is that it? Not really, but I'd love to free associate with you in a sleeping bag. Did you really have to say that? Sorry. You know what's happening, don't you? What? I could love you. Her brooks. looking into the last pair of eyes that seen the Batista in action. I'm up in the mountains with Shay and Fidel. Shay sends me into Havana to check out the scene. I sneak into the Palm Garden Cafe. Batista's over in the corner getting his palm greased. Meanwhile, a doctor who's on our side is into his other arm with a tetanus shot, which is really 45,000 mites of acid. <laughs> Batista takes off and flies to the palace. I sneak back to Dell and Shay and tell them what I seen. The rest is history, you know what I mean? What do you mean? Come on, I seen you on the floor. Maybe what you need is a change of scenery, huh? Like down at the bottom of the East River with an iron title neck, huh? <laughs> uh, after a long haul. Animals. I ain't doing this joint. I got breathing. If you're a priest that happens to be in style, you're treated with respect. But that's only temporary. Because the Cocker Spaniel, who was number one for 11 years, is now considered stupid, inarticulate, and hard to train. The problem is the unemployment. Others are behind the acts. Seeing eyes, security jobs, and they home. Occupation. What we need is our own political system. Right on. Why don't we negotiate? With who? And a can of kennel ration that clearly states 90% moisture. How can they charge 42 cents for a can of water? What do you care? You're not paying for it. Mr. Chairman, are we really going to be put away if we don't get adopted? Precisely. 113 breeds and only one number one. 
I say that we call it a general strike. And make sure that they know that we ain't kidding. As soon as she comes in here to give us the needle, we kill her. Well, maybe you're not afraid, but I don't want to die. You won't if you pitch in and do what's right. I never did anything right. That's why I'm here. I propose we take the needle with integrity and dignity. All in favor say aye. I'm proud to be a Mexican Harris. Do I hear anything on my left? Get off the podium, Heidi. We're going to kill a keeper. Is there anything on my right? One could make up his mind whether he wants to belong to a union. Do I hear anything? Alabibo. 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 It's fast. Bosley around? You ain't the honky killer, are you? Give me no circles, baby. Just give me your money. I ain't got no money. All I got is dogs. Worth anything? You decide. Give me that. They're gonna die. Sure, you ain't got no money. Here. What about there? Help yourself. Next time, you better have some money, or I'm gonna snuff out your life. That'll be five dollars. What the fuck are you talking about? You owe me five dollars for the pooch. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Adoption has nothing to do with it. We've been brought here in the name of science. It's a vivid section. On whose facts do you base that kind of a statement? I have an ESP contact with the governor. We're going to be wired by machines. Tapped on the head. Chopped up. You're a laugh a decade. The governor tells me that the hatch Metcalf Act passed in the 1956 Congress clearly states any shelter supported by state or city funds is required upon request to turn us over to research laboratories for medical experiments. I've reached a point in my life where I've made up my mind. Don't confuse me with facts. Please. When I get out of here, I'm going to behave myself. Love is where you find it. Don't be blind. It's all around you everywhere. Now I understand why the governor terminated his funds for the so-called arts. Well, at least you know why you're here. It's your me in the back of the black magic Stop down And spread that old black magic that you weave so well. I gotta climb. Those icy fingers up and down my spine. Same old witchcraft when you're meet mine. La 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 I can't 
can talk about. Dream I'm in under that old black magic called love. Excellent rabbit hunter. I can follow a trail that's been cold for 48 hours. I never pursue an escape. Under that old black magic called love. I've never killed a duck, though. <clears throat> under that old black magic called when the shit hits love. Tough to throw up from the graveyard. What am I doing here? I'm a penguin. Unless you can come up with a storyline. Stay out of my business. If you'd stop trying to change the world, you liberal fucker. You, I love you. You might learn to... Grow up, will ya? It's a little late for that, isn't it? It's never too late. Who are you to moralize with me, you irresponsible teeny bubble, you fascist, you raving whore? I am a socialist. Can I do anything for you? Give me a glass of iced tea, and I will make you pregnant. So when we get to the promised land, we will surprise the Messiah with a miracle baby. Oh, I love you. Seen you was restless. I didn't say nothing. Come on. Well, you took your purple heart down at a pawn shop. Did I say anything? And when we pulled the Brinks job, did I say anything? You're damn right I didn't. But Angie, what you did to my sister, I can't forgive you that. Ricky's family. You need a lesson, Angie. Before this, I would have let him cut out my heart for you.
why do I have to die? I never hurt anybody. As sure as I'm sitting here, you'll never die. Tell me the truth. Is there really action late? Is there really something else? What do you think? I'd like to believe it because then I could relax. The best is yet to come. Yeah? Well, when that needle goes in, I check out. Anything after that ain't been proven yet, Heidi. It's never been proven that there's nothing either. Who's joining me? I've had my eye on you. And when we get there, I'd like you to hang around with me on a permanent basis. Do you think you'd be put away with the rest of us? Well, let's face it. I don't think I'll be adopted. How did they get you? A glass smuggler brought me back from the pole. He got upset when he discovered I had to be kept on ice three hours a day. Last night, he left me in a hot tub in the Chelsea Hotel. Well, it doesn't matter if I get adopted or not. I'll be gone soon anyway. I wish I had some ice pack for you. Oh, thank you. Me too. Thank you. It's been good meeting you and the others. I've enjoyed it. I'm ready. At West Black Luck Kennel Club, I was hot. Won the bacon I did. 67, the Tampa Tropicana. 68, $83,000. I was hot. Miami Invitation by four lengths. Fort Lauderdale Stakes by half a length. 69, slowed up a taste. Couldn't keep up with Rabbit. Could have been in the money a few more times, but my trainer, Swifty, ran me too much. Just to fill in with the hot ones, give him a pacer. I was hot. At West Flag Luck Kennel Club, I was hot. In 68, $83,000, won the bacon. At West Flag Luck Kennel Club, I was hot. Swifty, you pisser. You ran me too much. Who do you know in Miami? I gotta get rid of this Miracle Baby. Miracle Baby, six to five, Coconut Grove. When I was little, they used to hide me in the closet because they thought I was too dark. My person's black and his wife is white. It's all over the place. It was expensive keeping me in storage, so he got rid of me. He got rid of you because you got no balls. I got balls. I got balls. Then help me when the keeper comes in. Why should he? We're not going to be put away. It's all a rumor and you started it. We just in here until we get adopted. Are you sure? We didn't do anything. Why should they kill us? Why shouldn't they? But think of it. They're the ones that have to stay. I would have been a major writer. I can take you, Joyce. You don't let a pencil I'd write you down and expose you. Nobody's into words anymore, you fool. <laughs> I'll bring it back. And if you're so big with words, then write us out of here. My person was wonderful. I don't know why I left him. You didn't leave him. I saw him deposit you last night. Are you sure? Yeah. I could have sworn I ran away. But if you saw him bring me in, I, I guess I'm mistaken. I guess so. I want a lawyer! I want a mouthpiece! Get somebody down here to give me my rights! I'll give you rights and laughs and uppercuts with a permanent nap if you don't calm down. All I want from you is two dollars. If I ever had two dollars, you will be the last one I give it to. Well, if you won't pay your debt, at least give me my laundry! You already lose your ticket. How can I sell this to you? What have I ever done to you? You insult me. I'm not into other people's laundry. I'm Siamese. I can take you, paper tiger. I am quite a hunk of beefcake. If you can produce for me a glass of iced tea, I will gladly give you my honey. Has anybody got a tea bag?
Ingram. Is that you, sir? Is that you, sir? Operator. Operator. I can't get through the, the lines. Operator, is this New York? Operator, operator, operator. I'm trying to reach Mr. Swifty. Yes. Mr. Swifty. Operator. Swifty. I, do, Late. Tell me what to do. As soon as I get it together, I'll be specific. No foresight. In this joint, there's not one original thinker. How can we die? We're never being alive. We are all living lies. Don't say another word. Do it. Do it, you ton of shit. Hey, handsome. Well, you can eat my banana pie. I remember now. I was here once before. I chased the white wall tire up Yonkers, and they brought me here. Swifty came and got me out, though. But he ain't gonna make it this time. I uh, might have written something funny. Then again, I, I might have written something serious. Who knows? One pencil, I could have done it. What's the odds, Jack? What's the spread? We were living in a two and a half. They wanted to move to a three and a half. And the landlord at the three and a half told them that if they wanted the apartment, the rules of the building made it very clear <laughs> that I wasn't allowed. <laughs> and they took the three and a half. <laughs> they made the right move. Thanks a lot. How come you want to die? I don't. Then join me. <laughs> I can't kill anything. It's not worth it. It is to me. <laughs> Then I guess you have to do it. Don't worry, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> you still with me? Just give me my instructions. Stay loose, I'm working on it. You better be, or I kick your ass and tear the grease from your hair, run down to your mouth and pluck up the bullshit you've been laying down. Yeah, that's a spirit. Thank you.
Give me a fucking beer, will you? I'm the best skydiver in the Western world. I made 96 jumps. I jumped from 24,000 feet and never missed a target. The last target was a gravel pit, 17 square feet. I hit and break both my ankles. The crowd's cheering. But they don't know about my ankles. I'm laying there. Must be 50,000 people. So with broken ankles, I stand up, and I take off the shoe, and I do the boogaloo. All the while, I'm throwing kisses to the crowd. It's unbelievable. It still is. Darling, darling, I want to have a physical with you. I only tally her with Afghans. There are none of those on the premises. There's still time. If you get me pregnant and I get adopted and I end up with a litter that looks like you, I'll bloody well be right back in here. I promise that I will pull out. Huh. How many times have I heard that? Before I die, I want to have one glimpse of your tits. Try somebody else. I want you, you fool. <clears throat> Why does everything have to be black or white? What about the grays? What about the plot? What are you gonna do? Get adopted. Beyond that now. I need a person. What, what are you, Barbara Streisand or something? Maybe your mama don't want to give us the needle, but she has to because it's her job. If she didn't like the job, she would have quit. Where are you going? I have to do it. Then do it. Susan, I should have said this years ago. The reason I've never slept with you is your stretch marks. I thought that was it. I'll wait up for you. I'll be back in an hour, and who knows? Is Rodney here? I can put you away for this. For three days, I lived on powdered milk. Want to report the kids in Chicago? I apologize. I chased General Sherman to Atlanta. All for you, buddy. You've never done anything for me. If you see Rodney, tell him you're crazy. So he has a chance. It's cats like you that let me know that there's hope. heard from you in ages. 
I bet. I just got a new set of Grecian beads. They're wild. Every third bead has a pair of butterfly wings on it. And at the end of the whole thing, there's a cluster of 27 fish hooks. Oh, take it easy, will you? I'll be home as soon as I finish up. Finish up? You hear that? That could mean a lot of things. Paperwork sweep the floor. Who knows? The city. Putting that rock salt on the snow caused me a lot of pain. Where we're going, there's no such thing as pain.
no respect anymore. I saw it on the river, the can't I said, and drowned by mountain stone. Hey, no start. You understand the language. Be negative. I can take it. I'm ready to be criticized. How can you be criticized? You have never written anything. Doesn't matter. I'm ready. How you fix for a publisher? Chief, no, no, no. the hockey kill is on seven. Hockey kill? Seven? Yeah. You tell it one. Hello? Are you there? Hello. Lieutenant Weintraub? This is the man you're looking for. This is the honky killer. How are you? What's new? How's tricks? Is there anything I can do for you? Listen, I've got another call. Could you hold on for a minute? I don't have a minute and you don't either. I'm sorry, but I do have another call. It better be your insurance man, honky, because you're next. Oh, hey, brother. My name's Brian Traub, but I'm cool, baby. I graduated from Grambling. In 57, I scored two touchdowns against Morgan State. Laminate your scrapbook, motherfucker, because you're dead. We lost him. Well, at least we know he's a brother. But if he's really the honky killer, why should he threaten me? Maybe he's got a thing for pigs. I've got a hunch. Maybe there's three or four honky killers and they're all running around getting away with it. And then again, it might be the Italian. On the other hand, it could be some lonely, desperate man who needs help. And then on the other hand, it might be anybody. This is wacko. Let's resign. Easy, Prince. Or you're gonna be walking a beat in Far Rockaway. I ain't walking no place, baby. Cause I'm gone. <laughs> Make believe I'm talking to you and make believe you're listening. I want to run! I want to yell! I want to leap into the sun! You got my two dollars? Stop pounding me! I'll pay you tomorrow. Okay, I'm sorry to bug you. What are you hanging around here for? The market's down. Yeah, I heard. See you tomorrow. Bésame mucho, como si fuera esta noche la última vez. Bésame, bésame. Mm -hmm. My lieber, 
mein Schatz. Zwei Herzen um drei Viertel Tag, wie hast mein Liebe zusammengebracht. Narvaya, Narvaya, Naya, hey, hey, Inna Naya, hey, Narvaya. It's a most unusual day. He likes throwing my troubles away. As an old native born Californian would say, it's a most unusual day. I want to touch your head. Please, may I touch your head? It was nice and warm. Thank you.
What's the difference? I dig your cock. Runny, 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 runny. I run guns for you. I gotta do the same for Peron, huh? I just went into the end zone. Nobody touched me. What do you mean, 15 yards? I ain't never clipped nobody. Hey, Angie. I don't mind you staying over, but we don't have to sleep together. You know what I mean? I'll tell you something, Angie. Ever since Vinny died, it ain't been the same. <laughs> not bad, not bad, but not like Angie. When Angie gave me a he had class, he had style, you know what I mean? He snapped you on and spun you around like a beanie. But keep trying. This is an unfortunate situation, but would everyone close their eyes? I'm going to give myself a quick jerk. Don't abuse yourself, boy. You owe me two dollars. No, sir. You owe me two dollars. I don't even know you. Two dollars for every time you run me around your track of bullshit. You owe me at least two dollars. I'm sorry, but I'm not really into that. Don't worry. The governor knows all about it. Don't worry. You'll come down and take care of this. I had this temper once and the needle felt wonderful. It'll be a splendid injection. Yeah? You'll be the first to cry, mate. And when a needle's inside, you'll accept your apology. It's time for you to make one. When we leave the Earth plane, all we do is move into another cosmos. The New Testament makes it very clear that beauty awaits us. Excuse me, but what you're talking about isn't even an option anymore. I don't think you're equipped to make that kind of a value judgment. Well, I happen to have a very interesting left hook, so I can make any kind of judgment I feel like making. Uh-oh. Ah! You're next! The only time I feel safe is on the streets. I can be myself. I don't have to play a lot of roles. Unless I run into someone I know. If you get out of here, what are your plans? To find all the creatures that I've raped and to tell them I'm sorry. That's very nice. If they hadn't resisted, I wouldn't have done it. I love your pompadour.
Would you accept my apology? <laughs> my person feels guilt, resentment. That's why he's coming down here to get me. Nobody's coming down here to get you. Admit that you're Jewish, Fido. Prepare yourself for peace and a tranquilizer. Where are you going? What do you care? I don't. me to do my act, but I'm already committed to the Super Bowl. I shoot to the tangerine bowl, and I get into a fight with a long hair over a mohair, because I got no hair. But I'll tell you one thing, if I don't get the right bowl, I cancel. The last time I bounced a check, my hair canceled. Angie, I never read it on you. Why do I have to die? I'm back in L.A. I'm standing on a San Andreas fault, one leg on each side. The fault starts to open, but I won't move off because it's my fault that I'm in here. At Big Sur, I trip over Kim Novak's bush, you know what I mean? If you seen what I seen at Chopper Quiddick, we'd all be up the river. Telegram? For me? Pass it under the door. I got no change. But I'll tell you one thing. Warner Brothers is out of the picture. The country's out of Salem. We're over budget, and I'm over Miami in a blimp taking pictures of the Orange Bowl. But if I don't get the front toilet, I cancel. I cancel the Beatles, the band, and this fiasco. But I'll tell you one thing. If I don't get the first head transplant, I cancel. But it don't matter, because tomorrow night I open in heaven. You're a good boy, you're a nice boy You're a fine boy, you're so bright Oh 
boy, oh boy, I miss you so. You push your luck, you never gave a fuck, boy. Oh, you sweetheart, I'm so glad you look so beautiful. 
Susan. Did you do it again? Damn right. It's too free out there. No. You know, if you don't sleep with me tonight, I'm going to turn you into the proper authorities. She may be your wife, but she's my woman. It's my duty to inform you of my constitutional rights. If I decide that you deserve to make a phone call, I still have the right to beat a confession out of you before your lawyer gets here. You should also know that anything I say can be used against you. The most important thing is that it is entirely up to me whether you live through the night or not. That's about it.
But now I'm back to show my sentence. Still I'm holding on the while you give me. Just one more night to taste the kisses that enchant me. I want no others if you grant me just one more chance. I've learned the meaning of repentance. I was the jury at my trial. But now I'm back to serve my sentence. Still I'm hoping all the while you give. I said that I was glad to start out, but now I'm back to cry in my heart out for just one more chance.